If you know a thing or two about Slavic languages, you gotta admit, some of them really sound alike. So today my question is, will I be able to identify all Slavic languages while being able to speak only one of them? So yeah, let me put my headphones and let's begin. And yeah, you are welcome to play along, I won't spoil answers. So yeah, the first language... Okay. Uh, immediately, I can say it's not Polish, it's not Czech, it's not East Slavic. I'm thinking about Southern Slavic, all right? It doesn't sound as, shar as sharp and harsh as Serbian sounds, I think. <laughs> You know what? I'm thinking about Bulgarian. Whatever, let's go with Bulgarian. I think it's Bulgarian. Let's reveal the answer. Okay, it was... Uh, <laughs> okay, I, I accidentally started a political debate right here. Um, yeah, I didn't mean to, I'm sorry. But it was pretty close, geographically at least, okay? So yeah. Let's proceed. Ah, this one is extremely easy. Immediately I can say it's Ukrainian. This one is definitely Ukrainian, 100%. I even understand the context of what are they speaking about. So yeah, yeah, it's basically Ukrainska mowa, as I said. To z tego trzeba wyciągać wnioski. W tym sensie powinien takich takich zdarzeń negatywnych, niezależnie czego zarzut. Okay, this one is Polish. I don't understand what he's saying, but I think it's Polish. I would struggle between Czech and Polish, but I think this one is Polish because I think Czech is a bit like easier to understand for me. If this one will be Czech instead of Polish, I will be really disappointed. My Czech friend will be really disappointed in me and like everything will crumble. Yeah, I'm having really high hopes for this one. Whew. He's Polish. Okay, okay, let's go. Let's go. So far, my only mistake was this Macedonia incident. I'm not talking about it anymore. To studentům vysokých škol a udržet je tak v Plzni. Zatím však poliká stovky milionů korun a město už po druhé navyšovalo rozpočet o obrovské sumy. All of these are news reports basically, and it's not a perfect peak for this kind of uh, challenge. Because I think I heard the name of a town or maybe something like that, like Pulzin. It's a Czech town, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm going with Czech, but maybe it's a really smart plan to make me think it's Czech, but in fact it's like Slovak or something. I'm thinking about Czech. Okay, okay. Yeah, my Czech friend sleeping peacefully today, okay? Konsens je, da je to edina afera na sodišču, ki jo bo uspela pred temi volitvami urediti globoka država. Medtem, ko je primer miroval praktično dve leti, je zdaj razpisanih kar pet obravnavnih narokov v enem mesecu. Okay, I think it's either Czech or, I mean, either Slovakian or Slovenian. I don't know. I think this uh, language has West Slavic vibes to it, definitely. So, uh, hopefully it is Slovak. Mm, okay, yeah. Good thing I don't have Slovak friends. Honestly, I didn't even know how Slovenian language sounds like. I don't think I've ever heard it. Whatever. лет, чтобы, так сказать, старости избежать и все такое. Но сейчас я понимаю, что это ерунда какая-то. Можно пожить подольше, посмотреть подольше. А что если это все-таки случится? Okay, this one uh, is Russian. We can skip it. It's my native language, so yeah, obviously I can guess it, right? Uh, yeah. Obyvatelia iných mestských častí, ale aj okolitých miest a obcí. Napríklad minulý týždeň tam zavítali mali škôlkári zo Žapokriek. Tí sa dozvedeli mnoho zaujímavostí o zvieratkách, ktoré v okolí jazierka žijú. Žijú tu aj netopier. Počujete? Netopier. Netopier. Mm. To máme to ako aj... OK, this one is hard. It's ambiguous. I don't... I don't think it's Bulgarian. I know why. I just don't think it's Bulgarian for some reason. Um, so it's not Bulgarian. It has to be Southern Slavic, right? 
and okay um it's a wild guess but i'd say croatian right that's a pretty wild guess though oh whatever croatian it is let's go okay for slovak well okay that's fine koji je prometovao na relaciji frankfurt pristina prometnog prevoznika deva turs sa sjedištem u Prištini. It's not a good idea to include this kind of uh, footage. Yeah, I picked up Frankfurt Pristina. Like Pristina is the capital of Montenegro. Well, Frankfurt and Pristina are pretty far away. I mean, Croatia could be in between, Bosnia could be in between and like many other countries. They just name dropped Montenegro and the capital. I'd say it's Montenegro. I'm ready to face the consequences of my wild guess, all right? Fuck, it was Hrvatsky. Yeah, I'm... Uh, I'm not very good at it, am I? Активіста з права рук спецслужба. Гэта яшчэ одна з існуючих версіяў. А ці былі у Шишова ворогі, хоча чуткі, що ён апошнім часом хвалівався за своє життя. Okay, this is Belarusian. Uh, a lot of people confuse it with uh, Ukrainian. They kind of have this thing when they say the letter V, which is present in both Russian and Ukrainian, using U. Yeah, I suppose they have something like a W sound, maybe? Okay, leave a like if you enjoy this. I wonder if you guys did it better than I did. Um, and yeah, overall, I think that's it. Bye.